All right, day three of our painting and moving vlog. We're starting in the bedroom today. Uh, this is going to be a very deep purple. It's um, Benjamin Moore's Summer Plum. We were originally gonna do grape juice, but I think it was gonna come across way too almost black at night, which is okay, because we like it when it's dark at night, but it seemed like too much. So we're gonna do this room with Summer Plum, and then our closet, which goes to the bathroom, which is right over here, is actually gonna be grape juice. So we're gonna have a little bit of darkness oh. all in the bed. Hello! <laughs> and uh, I'm not feeling so hot. Shocking, I've been sick like all of the last month. <laughs> all right, let's get into it. So we've done two coats of the bedroom now. The purple's looking pretty good. It is not perfectly solid. Actually, it looks pretty good. It is pretty solid. The only reason I'm saying it potentially not is because um, we did just paint it, so some of it may be drying. Anyway, that's looking decent. We have some of my in-laws furniture in the middle because they're staying here on blow-up beds. And then David is just finishing up the closet over there. Just not focusing very well. And then... Again, kinda. Yeah, you can see that it's definitely a different color in there. <sighs> okay, I am moving on to the studio now. We have done the bedroom and Dave is just finishing the closet now. We hope that they're gonna be two coats, um, but because they're purple and purple in makeup is usually not quite consistent, I don't know if two coats is gonna be enough. So we're gonna wait to see what that looks like in daylight tomorrow and then potentially we'll go over with a third coat but for now we don't know we're losing light we spent a lot of time at ikea picking up some stuff that we just needed alongside canadian tire because we needed just random crap for moving in anyway i'm going to start in on the studio now this is going to be the shade i think it's called gray wisp uh, again all the paint still by benjamin moore um, gray wisp because we wanted something that was relatively neutral for this room we obviously have a lot of color that's incorporated into this condo but because i'm going to be filming more often than not in here i wanted something that was not going to reflect too much color on my face and right now the green room is beautiful but i'm a little bit worried about how it's going to reflect on my face um, once i start filming anyway this is going to be like the makeup tutorial with the silver sparkly background room so gray is going to work out perfectly well That is it for day three. We have finished doing all of the hallways. I didn't really show any of that because that's really not that interesting. We've done the main entrance, which is over here. Haven't done any of the trim yet. Haven't done the closets. And we have to do a third coat on the bedroom because even we can see spots at night, which means that it's gonna probably not look that great during the day. But we're gonna come back and do that tomorrow. As well as all the bathrooms, which are still, still left to do. Uh, sadly though, we are losing my in-laws, so we're not going to have them around for the next few days of painting. They have been absolutely invalu <laughs> invaluable at this point. We would not have gotten this much work we done. Had they, enough, they said they're ha they've had enough, they're leaving. We would not have gotten all of this done without them. They brought so many supplies. It was really, really nice. And it's not like it was a close dis- that's a really loud siren. <laughs> And it's not like it's a really close distance for them to come. They drove like 10 or 11 hours from Wisconsin. So very much appreciate their help. All right, that's it for day three. I will see you tomorrow.